Unusual noises. Now sometimes your printer can actually cause some unusual noises when it's trying to home itself or you're 3D printing. This can happen over time. The belts can become loose or tight uh, as well as other factors like plastic uh, from the printing process get up into the rails and causing some binding issues. It could even be as simple as the fan got rotated and is now binding or touching one of the housings on the outside. So let's go ahead and talk about that a little bit. First I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate the, the noise that we're talking about. I've got it set up. I'm going to home this. Kind of sounds like that. Now what that is is actually the stepper motor stalling uh, while it's trying to move one of the axes. First thing to go ahead to do is go ahead and unplug power from your 3D printer and your USB and you can move the axes um, slowly back and forth and what you're going to do is move it from one side. You don't want to move it very fast because it's a generator is creating electricity you don't want to damage your electronics in here. So just move it from one side to the other and both axes X and Y. See if there's any single point that's uh, tighter than the rest. Identify that, whether it could be wiring that's getting in the way after uh, use, it could be the belt tension. Uh, identify what it is and try and alleviate that. I would also recommend to lubricate the shafts with a little bit of oil, make sure that they're moving nice and free. Another thing that can cause this is mechanical um, uh, interaction, meaning like uh, the fan. A lot of times, say you uh, change the tip out on your extruder. Uh, when you do that, you can bump this fan because it just snaps right onto the, the housing itself. Because it just snaps on, it can actually be rotated one way or the other. And if we turn this sideways, normally the fan is perpendicular, and actually that's what I did to Im imitate the noise right here. I turned it, and what, what's actually happening is it's causing the wires to touch the back panel when it's trying to move backwards. So make sure your fan is perpendicular. The main point is, is that this is normally caused because of a mechanical bind or extra drag in the system it can easily normally be identified by just taking a look at where it's stalling and having an issue and, and fixing that with a little bit of lubrication or a little zip tie, a little tweak on the wiring itself. Over time, this is natural and happens on all 3D printers because they move so much and for such a long period of time, they do require a little bit of maintenance. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks.